10th of March. We're in Radlett High Street. Come to me now. It's Tuesday, 10th of March. We're in Radlett High Street. Come to Darren. Should be a training night. We've caught up with Darren. Hang on, he's not walking. He's going to be a 10-mile run. Where's he going, Darren? Darren? He's getting to a restaurant. Every time we want to find Darren training, he seems to be getting into restaurants to have his dinner. Is he really training or is he just on a... Yeah. Is he just Thank eating? We're going to see. We'll Cheers. see him inside. Hope to see you again soon. Thank you. So, Darren, you're not training tonight. I am. Is this part of your training? This is part of the training. How, how long you made to eat this ice cream for? Hopefully just under seven hours. Fantastic. And, and, and what are you hoping to achieve towards the end of this ice cream? Pardon? What are you hoping to achieve? <laughs> no, I heard the question. Well, what are you hoping to achieve towards the finale of this ice cream? Have you stopped in there? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thanks, Darren. We'll we see, we see you back. At, we we'll see you back at home to complete the vlog. Uh, Darren has now now left the restaurant. I have, and it's, I have now left. Have the you left it? And it's back to your house for dessert. Yes. We're going to go back for ice cream and coffee. Fine. That that sort of helps with the whole routine, does it? No. Thank you. So Darren, we're back home now after your night's training. Look, look good, looked um, good, looked fantastic. Thank you. What, what, what do you make of it? Pardon? What did you make of it? Of what? Your training tonight. Well, I, um, yeah, again, you didn't turn up when you were meant to. We, um, not we, I, <laughs> went on a, a small run today, six miles. So where did the rest of you go? And um, it was good. It was good. I'm a bit tired. Darren, there's no offence, but a lot of rumours flying around this blog website, other websites, I've seen it on Twitter, that you've actually done no training so far and it's just been restaurants and more restaurants and desserts. I think How can you put in these accusations? Um, I can only say that you seem to turn up half eight quarter to nine instead of half five six o'clock when I keep telling you to come out with me for a run. But Darren we turn up and you're going into restaurants we need answers. I'm hungry. That's fair enough. I, Darren. I've noticed by the way well done on the blog three the uh, sound is in sync with my mouth <laughs> which is the first one I think. <laughs> well um, once again um, we've looked into it and we've got our technical team down, Brian Genson, Johnny Renson, da David Hodson, and we've Where is Dave? Dave's just behind me. Hi Dave. There's Graham. Graham's over there. Hi Graham. Tim's down there. Hi Tim. And Adam's up there. Hi Adam. Okay. And um, I'm here. Hi. Um, anyway, Regarding in blog two, we actually looked into it, it looks like your voice was out of sync with itself rather than the, the um, video being out of sync. So we've actually sat the camera and it's actually you were talking out of sync. I'm glad you adjusted that tonight, Baron. Thank you, Michael. <laughs> <laughs> now, Darren, I need to thank serious here, in all seriousness. Mm -hmm. Has your mouth <laughs> But Darren, this is, this is serious for now. You can't be a laughing clown like last week. Um, has your marathon training got... That's <laughs> 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 oh, the question. No, this is very serious. Please, please try and keep a straight face. Has your marathon training got much to do with the Cold War? <laughs> Yes. Uh, only that I've been out running a few times in the snow. So you, you would say yes, so you've got a little bit to do with the Cold War. Only in the snow. <laughs> Fine, I'm glad you've answered that one, Darren. Thanks for that. Thanks for that. So that's the end of that blog, end of blog four. We'll be out with Darren next week, hopefully, uh, watching you train. <laughs> if, that ever, nice. if that ever happens. Um, Darren, how do you want to sum this blog up? Um, good, good short blog. Keep um, watching the blogs. Keep giving feedback. Keep what, me? 
Well, you've watched it about 300 times on your own. Okay. Um, keep the donations coming in. I will. I'll w keep the donations. www.justgiving.com slash Darren Yanover. We're just over 5,200. I'd love to reach 6,000 if I can. Um, I know there's some more people that are going to be sponsoring. All goes to Bowel Cancer UK, as you know. And which Follow every us. day is in the paper. And <coughs> follow us next week when we um, bring out another blog. So um, until then. Thanks, Darren. That's getting a bit boring now. Keep running. Thanks a lot. Bye. Bye.